Hi everybody, it's Deb from D&D Art Gallery. Today I'm doing an acrylic swipe and I am fast forwarding um, my video just so you don't have to watch it that long. Uh, here I am laying down my paints and that paint is actually Modern Masters Pharaoh's Gold and Modern Masters Black Pearl. This second color is Blick Phalo Blue and Liquitex Basic Silver. The third color I'm laying down is Amsterdam Greenish Yellow and Modern Masters Green Apple. This next paint is Porage Posse Victoria, Victoria's Muscadine Wine. Very pretty wine color there. And this next lighter blue color is Amsterdam Greenish Blue and Pebeo Iridescent Blue Black. I just added just a little dab of that blue black into that paint. My next paint, this light pink color, is Amsterdam Pearl Red and Primary Red Violet Light. My pouring medium today is a little bit different. It's one part Mod Podge, two parts Floetrol, and a squirt of GAC 800. So that is quite a thick pouring medium, and I did add that for these paints at a two to one ratio, two parts pouring medium to one part paint. And now I'm going to start with my swipe color. And my swipe color today is 50-50 Amsterdam Prussian Blue in Payne's Gray. And this I mixed with Golden Clear Leveling Gel. Um, that was about a three to one ratio, three parts of the leveling gel to one part of that combined paint. And then I did thin it just a little bit with water. And you can see it's bringing up really nice cells here. Again, this is just a, a, a swipe, and I am just using a little piece of plastic there from a plastic file divider. Also, my base coat was just uh, Blick White with that pouring medium that I mentioned earlier, and all of this will be in my description. And I want to give a shout out to Lamb, that's L-A-M, of Lamb Jasmine Art. Uh, this is the, where I got the recipe for my colors and for the swipe color. The pouring medium, I'm sorry, for my pouring medium and the swipe color medium that I'm using. So if you get a chance, go to Lamb's channel. Again, that's L-A-M-J-A-S-M-I-N-E Art, Lamb Jasmine Art. And I will list that in the description also. Just touching up the sides a little bit with the leftover paint. And I did clean off that little strip of plastic I was using after each swipe there. Just giving it a torch now. And as you can see, I do try and move the pan a little bit, but it's, it's really not moving. It's pretty thick. Here I'm just taking my skewer and running it through just to add some different designs on here. Just playing around with it. giving me another quick torch. And at this point I decide it needs a little something else. So I take my balloon, and that's actually a water balloon, and I just start dipping it in the, in the paint there, cleaning it off between just about every dip. Just making those little pretty flowers there. Just, just something little extra for the eye to see. Thank you. 
I am glad that I went with that uh, Prussian blue and the Payne's gray for my swipe color. I think that really does stand out in this painting. And here I'm just trying to strategically place where I want to put these flowers. I, and right there I used my finger to make like maybe some stems on a few of the flowers. And when I bring you down for a close-up, you'll just see all of this and how pretty it really did turn out. Giving it another quick torch. And we'll be going down for our close-up. And here I am trying to show you the whole painting here. I'm so happy with the way that this turned out. And this is the upper left-hand corner. going down the left hand side and that really did make some very pretty cells and by doing those flowers it brought up a lot of layers of different colors there I just think a combination of the swipe and the flowers and using my skewer was was really a good idea for this painting. And here's the lower right hand corner. Just trying to show you some of those really cute cells there. And just there's the upper right corner. So let me know what you think of this video and give me a thumbs up if you like it. Make sure you share it. And ring the bell, choose all, so you know the next time I do post a new video. And subscribe if you haven't. That would be great to help my channel grow. And until next time, take care everybody.